guys, do you remember Abraham? God called him to leave his home country to go to a new land. So he bring his wife Sarah and his nephew Lot along. Now join me as we walk through the journey of Abraham and Lot to the land of the unknown. When God called Abraham to leave his home country, God promised that he will bless Abraham. And Abraham chose to trust in God. Later on, Abraham became very rich. He has lots of livestock and silver and gold. And since Lord was following Abraham, he too has lots of flocks and herds and tents. Abraham and Lot lived together at the same land. It means that there were too many animals at the same place that the land could not support them. There were not enough food for all of them and they have to squeeze with each other. And Abraham and Lot's shepherd started quarreling. So Abraham said to Lot, Let's not argue anymore. Let's separate. Lot looked around and saw the Jordan River Valley has lots of grass and water. It was the best land that he could ever find. So he moved his family and everything that he has near a city called Sodom. By the way, the people in Sodom, they were evil. They were sinning greatly against the Lord. But Lot didn't care because he thought that it was still the best plan ever. After Lot left, God spoke to Abraham that he will bless Abraham and all his family who comes after him, all the land that he sees. So Abraham settled down and lived in Hebron. One day, God told Abraham that he was going to destroy the city of Sodom and Gomorrah because of their sins. Abraham pleaded with God and asked, God, if there's 50 good and righteous people in the city, are you still going to destroy them? God said, if I could find 50 good and righteous people, I will not destroy them. I will spare the city because of their sake. And Abraham continued to plead with God with less and less number of righteous people. Until at the end, Abraham said, God, one last one. If there's 10, 10 good and righteous people in the city, are you still going to destroy them? And God said, if I could find 10 good and righteous people in the city, I will spare the city for their sake. God sent two angels to the city of Sodom and Gomorrah to look for 10 good and righteous people. But they couldn't find. The angels then went to Lot and told Lot that God was going to destroy the city. And they asked Lot to gather his family and leave at once to keep going forward and never look back. Then God sent fire to rain down on the city of Sodom and Gomorrah. The whole cities were destroyed. Lot's wife disobeyed the angel and looked back as she was running away. Immediately, she became below salt. But Lot and his daughters were saved because they obeyed. God showed mercy to Abraham and kept Lot's family safe. <laughs>